be open for a main. Spike. This does allow, though, the rest of Full Sense to start barreling their ways on through the A site. So it's going to be a full blown firefight here, Rap. And as the door Flippy. opens up, so does the opportunity. Yeah, that it does with Flippy. This is kind of precarious. He doesn't have. The I was about to say nobody's going to trade for him, but as this. He makes Von Olsen kind of face plan there as Chalala will have no qualms of dry peeking this and finding said Flippy. PTC fights pro, three letters to three letters, and suddenly South Belt are crumbling. The legs underneath them have been swept. Jaws the only one alive but manages to find the The zero point is there, but the bullets come faster. Wow, they just couldn't do anything about that A main smoke. It separated a good. We get our sustenance through our skin, you know, as it absorbs the nutrients from that is uh, given to us by the, uh, the, the sun. Oh yeah, dude! I get my sustenance from a lot of crispy chicken skin, but it does look like mid aggression is the name of the game. As this finds John Olsen, the will get a little bit of a bonus finding a frag with that Amazing specter. Lamy grenade. snacks will do the same. Swamp it appears this is gonna be yet another stifled attack by SBE. So so early into the round. Yeah, they weren't expecting that their smoke was gonna get pushed by defenders when there's PTC already riled up with the flash. And speaking of which, he's even more riled up here, helped out by the pick up already. There's a four, uh, 3k. You can't see Papachulo's already trapped up on mid. Even more bodies that they have to deal with. They only have sheriffs, and Limey Snacks knows this. He does take down Aziz, but Flippy is there on the trade. As he will push through the smoke, will get tagged up by that recon dart and will get a little bit of a bump on his shoulder, but John Olsen gets a third after that collateral and South built. Are once again relying on Ja to create something from nothing. Yeah, but Ja's on the Astra. He he can make stuff work with this, but commit this lockdown and it has been destroyed as quickly as it was put down with Lamy Snacks, but the Onslaught does not stop. South Build, they want to force this fight. As this, he doesn't have a dash, but have no problem with walking into that. Unfortunately for him, he is gonna fall. Flippy fights PTC, but the Lovey is going to be the anchor that they need, at least momentarily, while the rest of South Build the they finally wrestle control out of the hands of FS. Nelson does have the blades and everything that he needs to start working his magic in on this. He waits for Chalalala uh, to kind of help him out for the moment. KO Blade does make them known about the uh, near vicinity ness of the rest of the FS players. John Olsen starts, ignites the fight. Oh, that's a good headshot from Chalalala. It puts Ja in a deficit, and we only have Pro to remain. He's hit a couple of shots wow. from John Olsen! Spider Sense is tingling, or John Olsen just tingling? Whoever is providing any resistance here. So far, the approach hasn't been as creative as they're still gunning for B, but John Olsen and Lamy Snacks, they have this under control. He doesn't know that as this is as deep as he is, but no! Critical knife and a critical miss on the side of Aziz, and now... ...that he wants, but look at the trap set up by the rest of Full Sense. He peeks out and they counter peek him, but he's good on the adaptation, at least on the charge out or the... Anatomy is mean? <laughs> oh my goodness, then doctors are evil, is that what you're saying? <laughs> <laughs> I hate the skeleton. John Olsen obviously hates heads, Oops. as he's been so proficient in clicking on them, finding both pro, but Ja is here to trade him out, and now it's a little more remain. even. In fact, a little more advantageous on the side of SBE as they shuffle towards A. As this gets four of his own. What they would want to do is a really strong thing. Ja, if he just charges right out, would actually find Chalalala. And he does get refragged. John Olsen finds the one sneaking through onto short. That's a Ziz. And each counterpart have oh uh, taken their. The one to trigger the rotation. As he is patiently holding on to logs here. That could be just enough. For them to not check, doesn't matter. Lamy Snacks is gonna be here. The man with the big gun! FD will be. We might see a little bit of a scuffle here towards B Lobby, but John Olsen has that patience and has that dash to get himself out of jail. Now, Southfield's plans, they've been discovered as Lamy Snacks will chime in very, very quickly. John Olsen, although he might be blind, he is within the safety of the site. So far, South Belt haven't really found their timing as of yet, and they look very, very scattered. They are taking aim duels into left. their own hands. As this did find PTC here. Oh! Chop finds Lamy Snacks too. The recovery seems to be better than what we would have assumed. John Olsen is getting pre-fired out of his mind, and now you can't see that Flippy has actually gone in already. 
You talk about the scatter disc here of SBE, and it's starting to work out. They've run the clock, but they've opened up the opportunity once again for the P-Site. You really love to hit this, as you uh, mentioned there. The reacts not in the site right about now, but he's playing this very cautiously. He does win the duel, but now again, he's got to have to start pushing in. Okay, he's aggressive, he's angry, and he is massively underestimating where Aziz is actually hidden on. And that's back onto mid, where is Jet as well as oh. Chot we're waiting at. Oh my goodness, John Olsen once again revving up those friars, ladies and gents, trying to find Pro through that smoke, revealing where he is. Although site control spike is gonna be there, the speed. spike gets dropped by Pro. Poppy Chula recovers it, standing. and everybody swings. Everybody, including their mother, is trying to weed out Papi Chulo here, but he does find Lamy Stacks and he tries to keep his, keep his cool, but he needs to address that there's a big, big numbers advantage. The Astra, there is PTC just waiting around the corner here. Shalala has been a pretty excellent fragger, uh, and, but John Olsen, he says, you know what, Rav, I am the fragger. It is I, as PTC. He will also find one for himself. But bro, both Pro and Flippy, although Flippy will be knocked down as of the moment. Now, Pro, why wouldn't you swing it like that? He doesn't care. He does get free for his troubles. But now, Papi Julo is on his lonesome with the Nodin. Or rather, that was Lamy Stacks trying to rotate in. Now the numbers have been reduced to 1v1, but Papi! What a, what a round, Astra. I'm, I'm not... As they do run down the clock, Options are starting to dwindle down for full sense. They've already put all of their players here onto the B site. They don't want to waste too much of their uh, time here. And it seems like a Killjoy utility. He's already used a couple of banana swarms. He's going to be playing on Hell, and he might be even able to spot up PTC here, but oh, oh he just whipped a lot of the shots, and that's still going to give them enough time to actually fan on the spike. And somehow, some way, full sense of actually taking this into a very, very doable situation. Indeed, the way the events have transpired has not been very kind to South Build. It is once again yeah, possible. It is a 2v3, but as the numbers dwindle, it becomes less and less likely. Pro, he, he has to dig deep for this one. The tank may be empty, or rather close to emptying with this dangerous, dangerous crossfire. He's not going to assume somebody's here in hell or no. This fighter sends us to their tingling, but he has to land those shots. Lamy Snacks is there swinging perfect. Really steep here. South Built. Maybe this is their uh, map one jitters that they're pretty notorious for. Either way, Full Sense will happily take it out of their hands. They have no qualms of walking into the site, and John Olsen Ooh. making use of that Spectre, getting a free upgrade. But Pro's not going to make it last as long as it should. Flippy, though, he is going to be a bit of a bastion here, finding his KO counterpart. Pro has now repositioned and tree hits him with a fadeaway. But it's this. He fights Lamy Snacks, too. B, he fights a massive flank. But SBE, they hold on for yet another round. Kahone weapons for the LMGs, it's not going to work out. SBE Pro, it's still overzealous to start making things happen, but because he does have the crossfire alongside Aziz, it's actually working out. All these pop shots that he's doing is effectively reducing the numbers. Lammy Snacks, though, I'm going to have to try to break his magic in. He's bought up the Phantom, but can't really do anything else. Shaw has been spotted, and with 10 seconds on the clock, he will not have time to pick up the spike. He will not have time to go onto the site. The only thing left for him to do is just try to save this Vandal. Potentially prove fatal. Flippy, he's holding into the smoke, but he's not gonna have a chance to use it. It doesn't matter. The spray down comes out. He finds three before he finally falls. This crossfire is a little too lethal. And Ja will deliver the killing blow. But it does look like it's a bit of a ruse. as full sense. They employ their tactics towards A this time. John Olsen. Once again, will be the tip of the spear, and it has shattered onto the steel body of Flippy's KO. Ja will find Chalala, but the trade is a little too quick, and everybody's falling like flies, barring PTC, who is... Yeah, I'm frag, Aserai. Can't really find anything at all here, and Ja still finds a corner, but they've overwhelmed him, can't really do too much. They've done the damage, Flippy's still here to help him out, Aziz also, but the oh. numbers in favor for Full Sense. They just peeked out one by one, and now Full Sense, they can actually make this into a thrifty buy. Papa Chulo, he's done this before, I believe, also on Ascent. Can he do it again? There's so many angles left. to check out. He doesn't even know yet where to peek out, but he's answered the call! And Poppy Chula oh once again God. gets it 4k! I don't believe this man! They can really rely on Ja has proven to be a bit of a problem here as John Olsen is a little more wary, but they don't check close! 
Unfortunately for Flippy, he can't find anything this time around. Very, very beneficial trade on the side of Full Sense. The time is running out. Assist and Bobby Chulo. They still have their hands full here. They do have lockdown. Unfortunately, do they have the support to do this? Instead, they don't commit it. They are gonna lose assist. Papi Chulo, he's punched once. It's impossible. He can't do this, right? Again, we might just bear with this. That's right. I'm just at a loss for words now. There's a Nano Swarm. He's gonna get delayed so much. It's enough that his Killjoy Ultimate will not actually find anything. And they will have to try to maybe peek him out. But look at already the two-pronged attack coming oh. in from Papi Chulo here. Make something happen. They have to get Cheeky in on this one. They've already uh -oh. started making it oh, all the way through mid. Left. But Aziz hits a beautiful oh, shot that denies him any form of satisfaction. And Lamy's X and PTC to remain. But look at where PTC is. He's already crept up onto the site. Ja will try to repeat this. Psych down A. He was correct. Now Lamy Sex to remain. Here. Goes in. As he finds him. And SBE, they're not full sense. They kinda have to get their bearing set here. They kinda have to attempt to not be rattled by this resurgence by Southwell because the lane cause the divide is gonna be here. The zero point or rather the null command is gonna be invested as well with a guardian. Pro gets opened up. Now suddenly Southfield have a bit of a deficit to worry about. Ja, he finds a timing on everybody. Assist by Lammy Stacks, but no, John Olsen. He's a little too sharp with the knives. He even finds a second. And now the seconds left. Still waiting for that sound cue for that rotate. He tries to be sneaky, but no, Bobby Julo is too stable for this. Spike is still not down yet. This is still very, very doable for Southfield. But no, they have no idea as Bobby Julo checks in time. And now we are reduced to a 2v2. No way that actually happens to John Olsen, right? Like, th the timing of Papi Chulo actually spotting him out while, uh, while you do see Aziz actually just being there, that was way too awkward. But regardless of what happened, he's already opened up the opportunity! Oh my god, Papi Chulo has already lost! Here. Uh. Grounded. Enemy. Right here. Supreme down. Poison's off. He start moving his way on to double doors, but there's too many opponents to try to deal with. Jaws actually sneak his way onto elbow. And this guy's brain is just uh, enlarging all the time as he I spots see. out one as he gets away. The galaxy brain, it is once again expanding. And as I was mentioning, despite, um, pardon me by the way, folks, for a little bit of a technical issue here, but he figured it out. Spike He's going to be just putting out the TPs as he wants to get maybe a bit of a catch off. And speaking of catches, Flippy's already found John Olsen coming in from the back with a nice little tap with we the go. Guardian. And we've missed all these snacks and cha. They might just have to give this up and that they do. Just hoping to see that uh, Micro has created. It has allowed the, less, uh, the rest of the team for SBE to start planting on the spike and it works out. No flags will be coming through. Poppy's made sure of that. Lamy on the swing. Finally catches Ja, who is a bit too antsy, afraid of his position, and wanted to make something happen already. Not gonna work out, actually. And I was wondering if Papi Chulo was there. He's actually backed away with the rest of the squad. He has a Phantom, doesn't want to commit to a fight where he's gonna be outnumbered. And speaking of outnumbered, Aziz is already committed to this one. The trades are actually still positive for full sense, but only for just a fraction of a second as SBE, Papi Chula, and Michael explode. And full sense just about to botch the round here. Watch indeed, something that the camera might just kind of want to look away from as watches typically, they tend to be very... Uh, it's going to be John Olsen, he's equipped with the Operator, oh. and he spots out Ja just slow peeking it, and you know this man will not shy away from an easy... In, this, uh, in the team that is called Full Sense, John Olsen, Spike down, mid. He, it doesn't matter when he's going to get tagged up. You do see Lammy Stacks coming in from the corner here, yeah, and the crossfire is real. Aziz has to go above and beyond just to get this one. But Lammy's backed away already. Wants to use the Sova Drone for full coverage onto the site. And Papi Chulo, you try to use the Cypher Cage, but you are the... Because Aziz does have that Null Command, this will force the hand back in the full set oh! roster. And there could be the opening. PTC finds the kill, though. Flippy does answer it back. 
but that was onto Z, so he will be able to be brought back to life. That being said, though, Papa Tony's work is gonna get denied. Lee comes out with a beautiful second frag, and now they've been denied. The big smoke's coming in from the defenders here. They try to push forward. The spike has been planted in, but they still have Jao with the blade or with the uh, operator, but that's only him left now in a 1v X scenario. <gasps> Nearly lands the flick here, but survives just a tiny bit more. It's gonna be Thief. That was Micro pushing that Viper spit. I believe he still had one more snake bite, so it's again a bit of a lapse of judgment here. Aziz doesn't really care, and Micro looks to re emphasize that doesn't matter. I'm gonna bring this back. Jaw with the timing of a lifetime. Poppy actually fighting Thief, and now Lamy Snacks is gonna be on his lonesome. He does find Poppy Chulo for his troubles. He'll try to add maneuver SPE here. We'll have to go through a an enemy wall. Find Flippy. Oh my! He's going nuclear. But now it is reduced to a 2v1. He will be discovered. The bullets, they're still very much functional if he can find Micro. And no, Micro rectifies the mistake. That wouldn't have mattered whatsoever. Mm. And again, just asks. I'm asking so many questions here that it does look like it's going to be a repeat of the same round. Julo finds PTC. Aziz is chimed in as well. But Chalalala with that chamber is getting hunted down. And with 19 HP, a love tap would be enough. And there it is. Ooh. Guiding light to be a bit of a scouting force. But wow, the landing. Big, big shot onto Ja. Aziz will not have any of this. Bit of a mess here on Papi Chulo's side. He will drop his Vandal, and that is going to be in the hands of Full Sense. They are missing their controller, but the Seekers are here. They are out. It's enough of a distraction for John Olsen to capitalize on. Nearly gets a One bit of a haircut, remaining. but it is going to be a 2v, or rather a 1v4. They did get the spike down. down. Micro and all of his powers cannot bend off the rest of Full Sense. Excuse me. A lot, lot more successful. And speaking of which, that's what they needed to do. Make PTC a bit more antsy. Try to get that information. He's already used... I think a lot of his utility already, so he really can't do too much. And Poppy comes in for the swing once again. There's one still stuck at the back of the site, but Ja executes the target quite cleanly. Now SBE, they're on the forward trajectory to getting even more rounds in this first half, and it's all left to John Olsen. He's already been spotted, he's already been tagged. There's not, met, uh, not much left for him. That being said though, Full sense, not really backing away for the fight. Look at how many. The most information left. they can get. The tag was unfortunately not present. But it does look like they're trying to strong arm A now. PTC, he will not allow any of the march. Now Poppy is all alone, so he's left his own devices. And clutch this out. Nope, John Olsen will not allow. Her, except PTC. And now a brawl might ensue here. Full HP on the side of Southfield have a very, very slight health advantage, but what does it matter if you get tapped in the face? John Olsen proves my point very, very quickly. PTC dancing in the toxicity of that snake snake bite finds Jaw. And now looking fairly precarious, Asterite. Does he actually have a TP out? He does! Sneaky from Chalalala. Now they don't have to clear out Brick. It's all about the fight right here and there. Spike has been half, but the number is just overwhelming from- Can he actually hit the shot? Nope, not enough charges to actually make it work. Somebody dropped onto the- Shoot, that was Flippy out of his mind. Everybody actually turning a little bit too over damn aggressive, but John Olsen is prepared. The Marshal is the true adjudicator in this situation, as now Micro is getting hunted by- Go back to his teammates as they try to maximize the little ground they've covered. I've snuffed that out, right? Because it goes for the closest targets, but- Interestingly enough, it didn't. Oh, that's that's interesting. I think it only spotted out one, and then Aziz was able to sneak one in. In any case, it still will be that four versus four. John Olsen's already on the spawn. Pop Shield's gonna come into this with the Sheriff. Is he good enough to actually transition? Not really! What? And the collateral! John Olsen is the collateral damager. 4 to 9 HP. Still has a very lethal positioning here. Aziz, no time whatsoever. Chaz already lurk. I had as he thought that was such a good looking round for South for Papi Chulo. He has a lot of one-way smokes and he won't get tagged by the blade, so he'll have everything activated and ready. Full sense and SB they know this is this though will lose a number. And a big big number uh, of his health to a lot of straight fire. They try to poke out John Olsen here. Yeah, Papi Chulo should hear that uh that jump noise and that he does even finds a complete frag for himself. That mural theft is going to reveal all the secrets of full sense. 
as they're trying to keep this playing with fire here only has 13 health will be revealed himself suddenly full sense they turned it on its head micro the last member alive has to throw everything including the kitchen sink to stop full sense nope this is once again looking incredibly dire They've already called back no the Silver Drone. Back. They know already where Micro is going to be heading out of. And look at this three-pronged pinch coming no, through from Full Sense. PTC wants to think that maybe he's going to go through on Elbow, but that's not really the case. The eye is there. The flash is coming through. And even if Micro King could have picked up a Vandal. But that being said, really good stuff there from Lamy. Can be, despite having a big, big wave of momentum ever since, I believe, round 12. Well, but that is going to be traded Dandy. out immediately by both John and Flippy. And now suddenly it's Micro alone over again. And he has to force something out. It, that, that wall can actually be used against him. Still up and running for full sense. That was just a non-winnable situation for Micro. And saving the Vandal was the best case priority for SBE. That being said, as Flippy is holding down his very own. In the back of the side, this could actually catch out B for a ride. But now they spotted him. Although the swing, the counter swing from Jai is actually going to be prevalent. He might not be able to plant a spike now because the wall is down. But we'll still have John Olsen holding the cross. Slowly spike peeking planted. out. Jai was pre-firing. Knew exactly what was coming through this one. But they might not be aware that once again, Sha oh. is going to be holding the lurk onto double doors. That being said, though, Donaldson's fine one. PC with two. Oh, Papachulo is alone. And now he's got a 1v3 situation with Cha oh. again.